Hi folks, my name is Ian Baker. I'm the product specialist here at American RV. Today we're going to go over the Coachman Freelander 22 QB. The particular coach I have here is going to be on a Chevy chassis. It's going to be the Chevy 4500. That means that for our engine, we're going to have a 6.0 liter V8 in there, okay? Some people get a little worried about the V8. I promise there's no need to. It has all the power you need. This V8 actually has about 20 more horse than what its Ford V10 competitor has. So it's definitely a good chassis. Got all the power that you could want on there. On the motorhome side of things, okay, a couple nice things I like that Coachman does. One of them is that they're gonna use uh, colored fiberglass on here, okay? What that means is this is gonna be colored all the way through. So the advantage to you is that if this does get a scratch on here, you're not gonna notice it, all right? A lot, you know, on other manufacturers, it'll scratch. You'll see this big white scratch on here, not on the Coachman, okay? It's gonna scratch, it's still gonna be the same color underneath. Also, this one, we have the Camping Cozy Package. Okay, it does a couple great things for you. One, it's gonna give you heated holding tanks, okay? So if you are camping in uh, cold, inclement weather, you can flip that switch, that way your uh, holding tanks aren't gonna freeze. It's also, for your dump valves, gonna put the valves up by the tanks themselves instead of down by the termination, okay? The advantage to that is that your, your water uh, is going to stay inside the tanks, which are heated, instead of having your termination piping uh, with water in it, which would freeze. Okay, so it is going to be better for that. Now you may be saying to yourself, but Ian, I don't camp in cold weather. That's okay, the Camping Cozy Package still has a lot for you, okay? I haven't got to the best part. And that is gonna be the dual pane windows. All right, that's gonna be especially important to us. Um, a couple of reasons for that. One is that it's, it is going to be better insulation. Okay, now that's not just cold weather, that's gonna be hot weather too. If it's gonna be 85, 90, 100 degrees out, your AC is gonna be working hard, those dual pane windows are gonna help uh, keep either that, that cold AC air in, or if again, if you're in cold weather, it'll help keep the heat in. The other thing those dual pane windows are gonna do for you is help reduce a lot of noise. Now I'm not just talking about campground noise because that is definitely a huge bonus, but also when you're out on the road. Okay, if a lot of the Class C's when they're out there, they have the single pane windows, they're gonna kind of be shaking and rattling, you get a lot of road noise, not gonna be the case with the dual pane windows. You look at a lot of your big Class A buses, they have dual pane windows, there's good reason for it, because they work. All right guys, let's go ahead and take a look here. Check that out. Nice big open door there, all right? We're gonna have our cable attachment here as well as a plug-in. So you can either use this for storage or if you do want an outside TV, you can absolutely put it right there. Okay, easy access to propane. Open it up, there's gonna be our propane, okay? Easy fill right there. Okay. Moving on back, okay, to the back of the coach. One of the things I absolutely love, in the 22 QB, it may be a short coach, it may be a traveler, but you still have to have storage. And look at that. It accomplishes it with flying colors. I mean, you can't ask for more storage than that, all right? That's half your RV, storage, that's awesome. Okay, also this is gonna be roto mold on here, all right? And if you look, there's gonna be drains in the bottom of these. The reason for that is if you wanna fill it with ice, you know, and you wanna throw a catch of the day in there, or maybe a couple cold drinks, you can do that, all right? It's gonna drain out. On the back of the unit here, okay, we are gonna have our ladder. That way we can climb up on the roof in case we have to do any roof maintenance there. And also we're gonna have our backup camera, all right? That's gonna be a necessity when you're backing up, wanna make sure you don't hit anything. You have the backup camera there. Here is gonna be extra store, or extra door to that big storage compartment, all right? They know it's a big compartment. You have to get to it from a couple of different directions. So they have the back door so you can get there as well. Also, we're gonna have this nice large window on here. All right, that way if you do back up to a beautiful site, maybe you have ocean view, lake view, whatever it may be, we're gonna make sure that we can see it. Underneath the coach here, okay, is going to be our hitch. You gotta have a hitch on a Class C. A lot of people like to uh, bring a separate vehicle. That's gonna be a 5,000 pound hitch. That way you can pull another vehicle for you too. All right, folks, pretty much wraps it up on the outside. Let's go take a look at the inside. Hey folks, welcome to the inside of the Coachman Freelander 22 QB. This coach, as you see, is going to be small and compact enough that it's gonna be able to get in any of your small places, but it's also gonna be large. We have this nice slide here, really opens it up, so when you are inside, you have all the room you need.
All right, not only do we have a lot of room, we have a lot of great amenities. Let's go ahead and take a look. Starting our galley, we're gonna have, all right, good uh, countertop space here, okay? We have a nice single bowl sink. We're gonna have a high rise faucet on there. It makes it easier to do dishes. And if you want a little bit of extra countertop space, there we go, all right? Pop up countertop there, nice and simple. Up top, holy cow, look at that pantry space, all right? It's a great place, you can put a ton of food in there, okay? Love that. Next to that, we're gonna have our microwave, of course. Underneath, it will have a hood. It is fully functional with a light and a fan. And then uh, down here, we are gonna have our three burner stove top. Okay, we do have a electrical outlet in here in case you do have other cooking utensils. And then we're gonna have our oven below our stove top, of course. Um, we do get a nice drawer here. Okay, I like that. Extra drawer there, it's always good storage. And then we have storage underneath the sink as well. Okay, off to the side here, we're gonna have our eight cubic foot fridge and freezer combo. Okay, that is going to be um, gas and electric and it will have automatic switch over. So that way you can just let it run propane. Then as soon as you plug her in, you can switch it over. All right. Now here's gonna be a nice deep closet. All right, good hanging closet there. Okay, that's gonna be one of a couple we have in this coach, but that'll be one. And then you get great storage up here too. Okay, that's gonna go all the way around the bed. Great, uh, great place for extra clothes or anything else that you want there. Then as you notice, we do have a couple large windows here, which is awesome. Okay, gets a good breeze going through, you get a good view. And of course we have a vent up top. All right, let's go ahead and we'll take a look in the bathroom, okay? In the bathroom of the 22 QB, you'll see we're gonna have a very nice shower receptacle there, a tri-slide glass door. Of course, it's gonna have a sunroof there on it. Uh, so you get a little bit extra height and lets in a lot of natural sunlight. Okay, over to the side of that, we have our vanity, good storage underneath. All right, and up above that, we're gonna have a very large mirror. That way we can take a look, see what we look like before we head out for the day. Okay, towel ring off to the side of that. And then here in the corner, great storage, okay, which is gonna be above our stool. All right, and then of course there's a stool, which uh, with plenty of leg room. All right, to the side of the bathroom, Check that out, all right? If the one storage wasn't enough, I told you it had a second one. Look at that, full hang, full hanging, full length, okay? I like that because, you know, if you have a, a big shirt or a dress, you know, you can actually hang it, your dress can hang, it's not gonna get all crumpled up on you. Also to the side here, you have nice deep storage, okay? That can be very versatile. Socks, underwear, if you wanna put food in there, you can use it as extra pantry space, whatever you would like. Also underneath, you have a couple full length drawers here too, all right? Next to that, we're gonna have our dinette. Uh, okay, it's gonna be a U-shaped dinette. This is going to be uh, the espresso interior color, all right? Uh, looks very nice, you have a couple pillows here. Now this is a large U dinette, does have a couple of cup holders here, but the thing I like about being a, a big dinette like it is, is that this table can actually drop down, all right? So if you do have extra guests, maybe you have you know some in the bunk over, I'll show you in a minute, of course you're gonna take the bed, this can drop down and be another sleeping area. Also you get a very large window here, which I love, okay? Gives you a great view, that window does open, lets in a nice breeze too. Up above the dinette, of course, we do have storage. All right, we got a couple different doors there, okay? And then that's gonna round out our slide. Now up in the front of the coach, all right, here is going to be our cab over. Now this part, of course, does come up and off, okay? You can just flip it right over, land on there to, you know, when you're driving so you can get down in here. Otherwise, you put it down, that does make up the bed. You'll see here, okay, we have a safety net. This just clips right up like so, okay? Nice and easy that we have a safety net. Make sure no one's gonna roll out on you, all right? Also, up here, we're gonna have our ladder. So nice and easy, just hook it in right here. That way you can crawl up and in. And of course, we'll have a vent here too. Again, let some airflow in. Now, if you're wondering where the TV is in this coach, well, conveniently, it's gonna be tucked away right here. Okay, so if you're up here in the cab, you wanna watch it, boom, there you are. Maybe you're in the dinette, okay, there you are here. In the kitchen cooking, swing it all the way out. All right, nice and versatile. That is gonna have a DVD player, which is gonna be right here. And then, of course, our antenna. 
All right, guys, that pretty much wraps it up for the 22 QB. Again, it's a great traveler. Okay, it's it's uh, short enough you can get it into a, a lot of great campsites that some of your bigger RVs can't get into. You know, if maybe you're not taking it camping, maybe you're taking the kids to baseball games, basketball games, whatever it may be, this is the perfect thing to do it in. All right, once you stop, open that slide up, a ton of room. I'm telling you, if you haven't seen it, definitely come on over, check it out. If you do have any questions, or you'd like the absolute best price on one, please either give myself or one of the other amazing sales guys here at American RV a call. We'll be happy to help you out. Thanks and have a great day.